The Scottish First Minister is facing ridicule over the claim he is expected to make in a major speech. Hamza Yousaf has been mocked over claims independence could make the average Scottish household £10,200 better off. The Scottish First Minister and SNP leader is set to hail the figure as the prize of independence in a speech tomorrow. But Mr Yousaf has sparked derision from unionist politicians over the claim. Former Scottish Tory leader Ruth Davidson shared an image of a newspaper article with the headline, Yousaf, independence could give the average Scot an extra £10,000. She said, Davidson, independence could give me the body of Beyonce, the speed of Usain Bolt and Gillian Anderson for a wife. Scottish Conservative MSP Stephen Kerr added, Indy could give the average Scot £10,000 a year. Indy could make three new islands spring out of the Firth of Clyde. Indy could cleanse us of all morbidities. It's turned into the SNP waving random claims around like a fanatic medicaster trying to sell his last bottle of snake oil. And fellow Scottish Tory MSP Murdo Fraser said, you could win a luxury holiday home in Mallorca worth £3 million. In the first of a series of economic policy speech, Mr Yousaf is expected to say Scottish independence would raise living standards and productivity. Speaking at Glasgow University on Monday, the SNP leader will draw heavily from a report by the Resolution Foundation, which found that if the UK closed its income and inequality gaps to the same level as similar economies, namely Australia, Canada, France, Germany and the Netherlands, households would be £8,300 better off. He will say, if we use the same analysis for countries that are similar to Scotland, such as Denmark, Ireland and Finland, the difference for the typical Scottish household would be even greater.